tip-off. This place is a madhouse tonight as the Wolverines get set to take on the Hoosiers. In effect, this game is for the number one ranking going into next week because Kansas lost earlier today at home to Oklahoma State. So the winner of this game tonight figures to be number one in the nation when the new rankings come out on the Indiana lineup coming in a moment. But first, let's revisit the two times that the Indiana Hoosiers have defeated a number one ranked team in this building. Down to six, covered into the left wing. He finds Hornsby, top of the key, right side to Haston. One dribble. He throws it up, and it is good! It's good! We won! Indiana win! Woo! And they pile on top of Kirk Haston. And here come students now piling on top of the pile as well. Two-point lead, no timeouts for Indiana. Jones. Watford to the win! Yes! Yes! Oh! Unbelievable! Unbelievable! Can't believe it! Uh, definitely a scene Indiana fans will never forget. The win over Kentucky last season, December 2011. Can they knock off another number one team here tonight? Number three, Indiana. Number one, Michigan, with the starting lineup of the Hoosiers coming up now. of Indiana at a guard, a six-foot graduate student from Bloomington, Indiana, number one, Jordan Hall. At guard, a six-five junior from Upper Marlboro, Maryland, number four, Victor Oladipo. At guard, a six-foot freshman from Indianapolis, Indiana. Number 11, Kevin Yogi Perry. At forward, a six-nine senior from Birmingham, Alabama. Number two, Christian Watford. At forward, a seven-foot sophomore from Washington, Indiana. Number 40, Cody Zeller. The head coach of the Indiana Hoosiers, of course, is Tom Crean, who has brought this program back year by year, win by win. Went to the Sweet 16 last year, ranked number one earlier this season. And they would get back to number one if they could beat Michigan here tonight at Assembly Hall. For more, he can score, he can absolutely penetrate. These are two outstanding offensive teams, and we're seeing early evidence of that. This big ten way to do that. Oh. Magic Johnson back in 1979. One of my most favorite players. Yogi Ferrell's been hot from the on the arc lately. That makes him sell. Got a piece, and here comes Oladipo. Three on two. He can fly, man. He can fly. A oh, great ball movement. Ferrell for three. Tremendous ball movement. Reverse the, the argument as National Player of the Year, Trey Burke. And McGarry hustling back on D. Zeller runs the floor so well. Oladipo with a tough layup. To no good and good. Another rebound for Zeller. Hugs will have a tough time staying in front of him. Too quick. He hit the boat. Watford for three. They got all kinds of three point shooters. They got all the kinds of can't find the range. The only game he really struggled in was Michigan's only loss, the game at Ohio State. Zeller inside. He's going to have a big day. He's very versatile. Probably briefly, the under 16 immediate timeout is coming on the next whistle. Spike Albrecht is into the game number two, and we've got a held ball, and it'll be Indiana ball when we come back. Everything Indiana tonight so far. They have such a love for hoops. Oladipo the kick. Farrell 
And the first miss of the game of the offensive rebound and put back for Watford. I'll tell you what, Watford plays well. It's just a game. game. That's unbelievable. Up to 10. How about a Wednesday against Northwestern? They turned it over twice. Wow. Zeller left hand. How does he go two for 11? Two games have been really sensational for a freshman. Look at that move by Ola. Deep oh, that's a big time. Oh, are you kidding me? That's a little mini version. Hardaway rejected by Zeller. I think Zeller wants to climb the chance. I think today. maybe after tonight he's going to go up. Look at Ola Deep. I mean, that's a Michael move. That's a Michael move and a Michael Chan. Oh, he's big time. He has as much speed and athletic. And the rebound down to Hose. Five on four as Morgan hit the deck. Oh, great look inside. No one runs the court better than the Indiana that has been spectacular. Well, that's Hose right now. Great look. Gets the good angle. Zella has the ability to utilize either the left or right hand. Oh, a tough shot there. Bad angle. Good way to get the ball up the floor. I can't believe how good he has become. I cannot believe it. I know he's improved. Looking at his numbers, he's got great elevation. He's got athleticism. He can shoot the ball, and we know he flat out can defend as well as anybody in America. That is a big time PT player. Fighting over the top of screen. And look at them converge. Horford comes up with it, hits Robinson. Hollowell with a rejection from behind. What a great defensive sequence, but you name it. Right here, look at this. He tries to give a nice little pass for Morgan, and there's the defense by Hollowell. Comes from the offside. McGarry and Stauskas back in for Horford and Levert as John Beeline keeps trying to find a copy. There was a guy that said, I smell a little bit of a run out of Michigan. And that guy's sitting right beside me. Uh oh. oh. For three. Oh, no. That's a big yes. team. Zeller. Hollowell stays with it. And the freshman from Indianapolis nice lays it in. Bird. He says, you know what, big fella? You created your turnover. I'm going to get you the ball for a deuce. Zeller to Watford. Zeller! That's big time. That's big time. Cody Zeller leading Indiana with 11 points, including his follow slam in the last minute of the first half. But Trey Burke leading all scores. He had a full transition. Got to go to Zeller right there, but he's on his back. Fade away. Good. He really looks impressive tonight. He Burke shot. leading all scores with 17. Farrell to a wide open Zeller. Well, we see the best little guy in the league. Great the hands best. by Hose. They've done a great job keeping Hose away from shooting threes. All the depot and one. He is so acrobatic around the baseline. You're going to see the great play defensively by Hose. He's battling. He has a tremendous steal. Local high school hero. Here in Bloomington, as the good ball fake for you young kids out there, utilize that ball. But he's becoming too jump shot oriented. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yes, sir. If he squares up. And, uh, our guy Jalen Rose, who went on to the national championship game that year in '93 before losing to North Carolina. Will she heave with a baseline jumper? Now, forget about it. That's absolutely ludicrous. Farrell. Nice bounce pass. Watford with a finish. See, that is points per possession. Sheehy will try it from the other side. Hollowell. What a great job carving out some space. He was the place he could drop. Indiana really struggled. He was 2 for 15, shooting threes and 11 for 33. All the depot. Zeller. He's been playing Zeller lately. Doesn't get enough. All the depot. Zeller again! Nobody puts a body. The offensive rebound. Robinson's going to have a heck of a career at Michigan. He's just going for a little struggle. This Zeller with the offensive rebound. Twice McGarry's come to help on the Oladipo drive, and twice Zeller's yeah, been to this year. Though. Absolutely. And maybe, maybe the player of the year. Unanimous. 22 yeah. tonight for Bird. Hollows from the corner! That's three of three points. points and six three. rebounds. See, that gets some touches inside to Zeller. Oladipo wrapped up. And oh, a foul yeah. before the shot. Another look at the last play. I misinterpreted the signal from Mike Sanzir, the official. 
they counted this basket. I thought the foul was on the floor, and he would go to the line for one and one. I agree with you. I agree with wow. you. I'm surprised. Yeah. They counted the basket. They counted the basket, so he got a chance for a three-point play. Pick this. Hardaway not in the game right now for Michigan. Watford inside over Robinson. That's a great move by Watford. Rather than drift to the perimeter. Heavy traffic. Yeah, Zeller bails him out. Still loose. Look at the hustle by Zeller. Oh, we need to get an All-American that hustles and becomes contagious. Oh, what a great play by Zeller. Look at this big fella. They're going to get after it. There's the ball. Yeah, look at the big fella, number four. I mean, he's going after that like it's his last beer. <laughs> And as his dance, I love that. I love that, Cody. His mom's about one of the key ball. guys for Indiana tonight and all season long. Cody Zeller's been outstanding. He really set the challenge early in the game. He showed right away that he was going to be after, and that he wanted the rock inside. Showed his versatility, a little jump shot. The ability to move without the ball. He gets this as the offensive rebound. He did it all. If I'm picking one guy, you said to me, start counting. Big season on for Yogi Ferrell. Burke launches about a 32-footer. Sheehy down with a rebound. Let and the, Michigan will concede. Let the party begin. Oh, Kilroy's they jump jumping with joy. Who's your hysteria? Oh, a little showtime. Mr. Oladipo, wave it off. Wave it off. But it looked good. It looked good. He's a mini version of a young Michael Jordan. I'm not saying he's Michael now. He's a mini version of his kind of skill set when he played in college. He was one of the stars tonight for Indiana. They had five players in double figures as they defeat Michigan. And very possibly Indiana will be the number one ranked team of the nation when the new rankings come out on Monday. Two outstanding teams who could go a long, long way in the NCAA tournament. For Dick Vitale and Shannon Spirit, I'm Dan Shorter saying thanks for watching and so long from Bloomington.